hello, this is Dorothy Smith, I'm a close to my heart independent consultant, and I wanted to show you my card organization. I kind of referred to my card, how I organized my cards when I did the You Got This cards, which you can see are sitting on top there, and there isn't any room for them. This was our large organizer um, until we got our last catalog and they've enlarged the catalog. So I'm showing you that it was divided in four sections and I labeled them birthday and thank you. And then the next two sections were other holidays and greetings. And so that greetings has gotten really crowded. And so I purchased one of our new organizers from the um, recent catalog, which is up December 31st of 2018, but come January 1st of 2019, it's still in the catalog. And so this is the new large organizer. Again, it's divided in fours, and it's really perfect for our stamp sets, but I decided it would be perfect for my cards, and it's a little bit larger so I can put more cards into my box and this the exterior dimensions on this are 17 and a fourth by 15 and three fourths by seven and a half so I really end up with quite a bit more room there's my you got this cards which I've done the video of and here's some other cards that I'm going to uh, use I've got a friend that in Missouri that I need to send a card to and I just received her Christmas card. So um, I've got all sorts of pretty here's to you, which is a beautiful card, which actually could be a birthday card too. Anyway, I've got a lot of really nice greeting cards. And um, now I've got more room for them. And they can fit in there, and I still have room to make some more cards. So when you've got this, you can also see uh, which cards you kind of need to make more of. So I have half happy birthday cards, but I don't have a whole lot of them. And so I probably need to make some more birthday cards. And then my last group is holidays, like other holidays. So there's like, oh, that's ones for retirement and Christmas and uh, New Year's. And, um, you know, I've got, oh, I think some Easter cards. Here's a cute little Easter bunny card and a Valentine's Day card and another Easter card. So there's some other holidays. So you can kind of look real quickly and say, gee, I need to make some more of these or I need to make some more of those. Um, so I'm pretty happy and what I'm doing right now is since I've run out of my label, another label um, refill for the Brother P-Touch, I'm just taking them off the other box. And so I kind of decided instead of putting it on the side, I'm going to put them on top because that's sort of how I look at my box of cards. So I'm going to put birthday up on top there and then I'll... Um, take the thank you off and put it on top and then I'll do the same with the greetings and the other holidays which it could just be holidays actually instead of other holidays because it kind of encompasses all of them including some Christmas so there's my greetings and I'm really good on those. I've got a lot of those cards. And then the holiday. And I could stand to make some more Valentine's cards and um, boy and girl birthday cards. So I'll have to look in my new catalog and see which card section, which card kits I need to make to um, have cards readily available. So here's the new, my new card box. And this is Z4206, but I'll put all this information 
for getting the new card uh, or box, the large organizer, you can put anything in um, at the bottom of the video. So thank you for watching. I love my beautiful box there. It's got a nice etching on the top. So thank you. Y'all take care. Bye now. Thanks for watching my video. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and visit my blog at dotscrapbooking.com.